But first, we want to go straight to a big announcement from Tampa International Airport. It's about to become the first airport in the nation to offer on-site COVID-19 testing for all of its passengers. 10 Tampa Bay. Tim Tampa Bay's Eric Glasser is live at the airport to explain how the program will work and which passengers it's designed to help. Eric. Hey, Kat, Caitlin, yeah, you know, I think that it's probably going to help those who are traveling internationally the most because there are still a lot of countries out there that are requiring U.S. travelers to be able to show that they were able to test negative for COVID-19 within 72 hours of travel. So Tampa International has now teamed up with BayCare Health Systems to offer two types of COVID-19 tests for passengers. Baycare has set up a collection and testing area inside the airport between concourses E and F. The first test, called the PCR test, costs $125, and that's the one that's required for most international travel. Usually it takes about 48 hours to get results, so people who know that they're going to be traveling can come to the airport, get the test, get the results within those 48 hours, and then the next time they come back to the airport, they'll know they are cleared for travel. The other kind of test that's being offered on site is more about peace of mind. It's an antigen test that can show if someone has come down in contact with COVID-19 within the last five days. And that test, which costs around $57, can be processed right here on site in less than an hour. This is the only airport in the whole country that is doing these tests for anybody going to any destination on any airline. Only TPA is doing this and we hope others will follow. Testing is the key to getting people back to travel. So for now, this is just a, a pilot program. They're trying it out for a month. They're gonna see if the testing is going to work out, whether it's in demand. It's available between 8 a.m. and 2 p.m. The airport says it makes no money on these tests. It's really just about trying to maintain TPA's reputation as a passenger-friendly, convenient airport, and of course, to try to increase travelers' confidence because they really want to see the traveling public get back to it. There are other out airports out there, I should mention, that do testing on site, but that's really for pilots, for other members of the crew, if you will, for workers at the airports. This, again, is going to be the first airport in the nation that offers this sort of testing for passengers. Again, a pilot program, they're going to test it out through October, and if it works out, they'll talk about expanding it. Caitlin? If you want to know more about that new program, we have all the information on our 10 Tampa Bay app.